Good day there viewers, today I'm here to show off my Umbrella DVD titles. Now, I basically got all my Umbrella DVDs and scattered them across the floor. However, there were some uh, I was looking for. I de I'm certain I know I have them, however, I just couldn't find them. I was looking everywhere for a few titles and could not seem to find some. So, uh, for now, I've just basically found the ones I could and I've scattered them across the floor. So... Here are some of my umbrella titles. So first off, we've got this big umbrella. I've shown this off in a video. This is a Tinto Brass box, and that comes with seven of his movies, and that's a really good box set for anyone who's interested in Tinto Brass movies or wants to get into them. Um, going across the top, we've got the Grindhouse Experience. That's four movies, the Corpse Grinders. Really, really great Grindhouse stuff in that box set. Uh, then we've got Patrick. Patrick's an Ozploitation classic. i got this umbrella um, special edition. Silent Night, Deadly Night 1 and 2, if you want to see, I've always wanted to see it, so I decided to get the Umbrella local release. Uh, we got Nightmares, that's a great Aussie flick there. Martin, oh I love that movie, great, great, great vampire movie. Going across we've got Tales from the Dark Side, this is like Creepshow 3, and pretty much this is officially Creepshow 3, this should have been Creepshow 3, but um, instead they made the other shitty movie which was not related to Creepshow at all. Driller Killer. This is the local um, Aussie DVD, however, it claims it's uncut, but it's not. It is the censored version, and the uh, the film print looks like shit. It looks like someone literally took a shit on the film print, smeared it up, and put it on a DVD transfer. It is horrible, and it's cut. Avoid this release of the Driller Killer. Then we've got Basket Case. This is a classic. This Umbrella DVD is particularly hard to find now. I, um, good luck trying to find it. You will not find it anywhere. Um, that's the uncut version. It's identical to the US Something Weird DVD release, and this is a great release of Basket Case. Deadly Blessings, that has not been released outside of Australia yet, but there's the um, good old Aussie local release. I've shown that off. Great movie, great DVD. Frightmare, I love that movie. Uh, excellent, excellent. Peter Walker, P um, Pete Walker horror. Um, cool. Day of the Dead, I already have Day of the Dead, the US edition, but I actually got this in a basically a bundle of DVDs, so I thought, why not have a second copy of Day of the Dead? The Crazies, that's George Romero's Crazies. The Fun House, love the Fun House, got the day bill, and the DVD is awesome. It has an interview which is not on any other DVD in the world. A Razor Head, that's another local release. Now, this is interesting. I found this lying around. I must have got this, like seven years ago or something. This is Trilogy of the Dead. This is Umbrella's um, put together the Dawn of the Dead, the Night, Dawn and Day trilogy. And I find it, I find it interesting. I, I found it lying around. Comes with a little insert, three discs, nothing special. But um, yeah, I, I don't think many of those are left around now. Um, Henry Portra Serial Killer, this is a great movie, it's the uncut version, um, and this Umbrella DVD is really good because it has a shitload of extras that's on the US disc. Zombie Flesh Eaters, uh, Zombie 2 that is, Zombie Holocaust, and Burial Grounds. I love these DVDs because I like comic books, and uh, these three basically came in this zombie pack here. So yeah, that's some of my, that's my Umbrella titles. I, I know I... I definitely have a few more lying around. Um, I just can't seem to find them right now. But when I do find them, I'll show them off. But for now, those were uh, my local Umbrella DVDs. Umbrella DVDs are great. And um, without Umbrella, we honestly, Australia, like Aussie Roach, I said, it would be a DVD wasteland. Um, so yeah, there we go. Hope you enjoyed. Oh yeah, found one more title just lying around. This is Phantasm and Phantasm Comes Again. Uh, this is a great exploitation movie and uh, the first one's excellent the second one's just crap but yeah that's another umbrella title I just found lying around there